gap and he's gone for it. Picks out Lalana. Well, that isn't a bad ball. It's a great run from Ive. Real purpose, real drive in it. Really committing that back four of Crystal Palace. And as he shoves the ball wide to Lalana, he's only got one thought in his head. He just wants to get it in early for Benteke. He's not got much room, but he just tried to flash it across the goal. Left foot, Coutinho. Coutinho on his right foot. Couldn't get the... Goodbye, picks up. He'll always back himself. Yeah, he maybe had a little slip pass towards Balassi, but he always was going to take it on. I think, if anything, he was caught in two minds, whether to chip it or strike it. Just he had a little look up there. Just tried to put the laces behind it and ping it. Don't think he had the room to clip over Manuel. A little bit in between in the end. It's a hot. in the way, but this is Yannick Balassi. Crystal Palace are bringing trouble to Liverpool's door again. They've started well, and they have hit the front. Well, Wilfred Zaha has cross, but he's choked a little because he's not got the angle to flash it in between defence and goalkeeper. But when it's dragged back, I think Chan does nothing really. He gets a foot on it, but there's no conviction in the clearance. The only thing he does is keep it alive. Balassi, big and strong. I don't think Moreno covers himself in glory with that challenge either. But when it comes wide, this is what I'm talking about. Doesn't really have the angle, chokes across. Chan is almost trying to cushion it instead of clearing his lines. And what he does, he cushions it straight back to Balassi. He takes a little touch and dispatches it with his left foot through a ruck of bodies. Mignolet has got no chance to see that soon enough. It's a smashing finish. The first, Berto Moreno. Who filled everyone. There's Ibe. Training. Well, still with the climb and in front of him, it was Benteke who got to it. And Hennessy responded. Yeah, I think Hennessy sees this late. Benteke is up and he headers it downwards. And it takes a little skid. He's very, very late in reacting. That's because James MacArthur is right in the viewpoint. Moving away from MacArthur. Lalana. There's Klein. Fizz back through to Lalana. Great take from Lalana. Benteke couldn't apply the finish. Great feet though from Adam Lalana. Yeah, what a such an important job for the likes of MacArthur today for Palace, stationed in front of his back four. There's Emre Chan. Flying cross, Benteke. Well, that was much better. That's exactly the service that the big fellas want. Don't be too fancy. Get it out your feet and deliver it with a bit of pace. Generally, he won't disappoint. I'm just watching Neil Swarbrick taking a fall. Outside the box here, but what about that for a take? Because that's fizzed in. Well, Lana with enough awareness around them to pull it back. It's a great stop by it was Scott Dan actually. I thought it was Delaney at first. I really appreciate that. Well, go and test them out, Mignoli. <laughs> he might not appreciate that one. <laughs> Where's Yannick Balassi? Offside against Balassi. Nice finish by. Bakary Saka, but the flag had long gone up. Yeah, it had. I don't know what Simon Mignolet is doing, giving him that ball. The big fella's just come back on the pitch. He's not sure if the knee's OK. Here you go. There's a nice little slow pass to deal with with Balassi shutting you down. You can see there, clearly offside. Nice finish from Sacco, though, nonetheless. Nothing like a little bit of sympathy from your teammate, is there? Lana again, Adam Lalana. And we've seen him do that many, many times before. Yeah, it was good. They didn't have cover Crystal Palace this time, so they had the overlap and run. As he comes outside MacArthur and Balassi just wants to get a little angle on it, just to try and open up the goal. Put it from outside the post and drop back. Manager liked the effort. This is Jordan Ive. Klein making an angle on that far side. Here is Klein. Lalana. That's Coutinho. 
The Brazilian magician is there again for Liverpool. He once again dons his cape and comes to Liverpool's rescue. Yeah, it's a really controlled finish, isn't it? Benteke plays his part. So does Klein, so does Ibe. As the ball comes in there, Ibe, who's been very, very good in the first half, he's just waiting on the run and timed the pass to perfection. And like Zaha's cross, it's choked a little bit. Flick from Lallana, dummy for Benteke. And it's a lovely side foot finish past Hennessy. Lots of power on it. He's not lashing at it, he's controlling it. He's looking for the angle. And there's a finish. He is back on top of his game, Philippe Coutinho. And Jurgen Klopp celebrating in his own unique style. Not to concede from a set piece in the Premier League so far this season. I'm hoping to keep that particular statistic intact here. That's Lovren. And Hennessy right on his goal line deals with it. Yeah, he did deal with it. Uh, I'm just wondering where James McArthur is a very lucky boy. He doesn't get more of a contact on it. I thought he had a little swipe when the header comes in. Lovren just feeding it back in there. Not a lot of power. Takes one deflection. And I tell you, McArthur's very, very lucky he doesn't make contact because I think if he did, it might have beaten Hennessy. Teke and Skirtle was something planned in the middle. It's gone beyond those two. It was Lovren again who met it. Again, Palace stand their ground and fired over the top by, of all people, Lucas. Now, I wasn't sure how much of the deflection was there, but solid contact from Lucas. Again, it's Lovren and it's James McArthur right in front of the goalkeeper. It clears his lines. And... There's Benteke. Philippe Coutinho. It's Benteke. Sorry, put the challenge in right at the last. Yeah, good defending. Didn't give it up. Lovely little take from Coutinho. On his right hand side, I thought he was going to let it drift through them and open up the game to Moreno. Love a little take there and slips in Benteke, he just wants it on that strong left side, but a top challenge from Suarez just does enough to put the striker off. Could have been a corner actually with the flight of the ball. Moreno's corner. Hit away by Yannick Balassi. There goes Wilf Zaha. We have to do this all alone as it stands, and he might just do it. Bakary Sacco is up in the middle. Bakary Sacco with that left. Moreno. Benteke closing in. Couldn't get over the ball. Yeah, spot on. Just couldn't get high enough. You're right, though. What a pace this game has. End to end for the last 10 minutes or so. It's a lovely little stand up. Lalana just knocks it on, Moreno just feeding that and it's a great little ball, but Teke is up, just couldn't get high enough to get the head down and powered under the crossbar. Again, it's lovely little feed in from Moreno, much better quality from the wide area, but what a chance. What a chance earlier on for Sacco. I see the Palace, Coutinho responding for Liverpool. There's Firmino, Lalana. Well, Benteke had two options. He could have let it run through to Coutinho, but he decided just a little wall pass for Lalana. Good run from Firmino. Head up. A little, little weight in the pass, just a cushion touch there. Lalana just trying to find the top corner, trying to place it in there. Well, we... This is Jason punching. Mignolet call into action. The defenders in midfield trying to whip it into that top corner. Mignolet's always get lots of time to see it and comfortable in the end. Delaney, Wickham are all forward here. Wickham is alone right now. It's gone beyond him. Dan met it. Mignolet responds and Dan again. The Liverpool fan strikes against the club he loves at the place he loves. But there's no room for sentiment. This is business. Well, you, you've had enough warning. Liverpool set up this zonal marking system. And for me, well out, well, well outnumbered in terms of the big guys to go and attack it. Connor Wickham, you said, was free. Scott Dan has been free nearly every single corner. As it comes in, Firmino's trying to get all over him. He doesn't do enough. 
And when Scott Dunn wins the first header, Manuel makes a save. Firmino just doesn't react. His back's turned, but Scott Dan certainly isn't. And this time, it's a real solid second header. First one down to him, comes back, bang, right in the top corner. I said about Alan Pardew pouring white jerseys forward in search of the winner. I just wonder, have they just got it? The man from Liverpool, the Liverpool fan, strikes at the heart of Liverpool. And Chris... This is Philippe Coutinho. Coutinho! Pushed over by Hennessy. A yeah, good save from Hennessy. Loads of power on the left hand side. James MacArthur just prepared to try and put him on the left side. He's weaker one. But he gets lots of meat behind the shot. And a good save. Fired in by Lalana. Misses everybody. Coutinho, he's got Liverpool off the hook once. That's Moreno. Hennessy bundles it behind. Well done, Wayne Hennessy. Fully concentrated. The cross didn't come in, but almost found the foot of the post.